tokonya wa poroli ta ke tsare ku ya murutso ane ya ku korwa ke tina pere ku kurumania dini ku tokoli ni wake e kwara gyo ki haro ni ki anya yo ka utsine ya nairobi de ikere ka ri akere ni ko era poroli ni odo wa ngara ku eri ya idiye tsana pere ku hatsereria kenya e ku kire kana tsi ngara ku eno isha geiro isha geiro na jirana na muno ni odo wa ri wainene de le koreto ri ke tina pere na gwa kana ruto au ge tsi atsi maho ya ni ke dogi afata no yo nigo ogukoro ole mutugo wake thini wa utongoria wake ajira ya kuhe kanitha kanya kayo utongoria ini akwara ede ya mahoya maya aruto ne ogeti ati ari na muiho ko na ari na uma ati bura ne gukoro ikiuna thutha wa mahoya maya kyo dirikali e hareirie na bego ondo mwe na fataraitha cia kuhe ari mi nigo mahote kuika migunda ine kuhanda wona bura ya rikia witika kuja katika maombi haya nimepata furaha kubwa na nimepata hakikisho kwamba kanisa sasa inaelewa mahali pake katika taifa letu la Kenya leo nitalala mapema na nitaamuka kesho kuchelewa na nitalala na viatu so the prayers today to intercede with God to give us rain are more than welcome. Your Excellency, we face many challenges with our young people, and these prayers are most appropriate as we pray for those who are selling cheap and illicit liquor to our young children, that God can touch their hearts to change their ways and be merciful to our children. We have a plan that uh... Uh, the Kenya Kwanzaa has given us. I want to ask that we continue to pray for that plan, the dream of our president, so that the Lord can help them to be able uh, to fulfill uh, the, the promises that they have given to Kenya. It took a word of the man of God to, for there to be a famine for three and a half years. And it took the same man of God to speak a word and there was rain. And therefore, I know Kenya is embracing for a great harvest in the mighty name of Jesus. Kama serikali, tumefanya mipango yote. Mipango ya mbolea, mipango ya mbegu, mambo yale ambaye anahitajika, ili tujitayarishe kwa sababu tunajua mungu atatupatia mvua na Kenya itakuwa na chakula na tutaondoa aibu ya njaa katika taifa letu la Kenya. Kenya is embracing for a great harvest in the mighty name of Jesus. I believe after repentance today, God is going to release the natural resources that are in the land of Kenya. Kenya is going to be a fruitful land. In the name of Jesus, it will be possible for us to benefit.